Jonesy, we have a theory that we've developed on this podcast. When we see a race that we don't like the favourite, but nothing else in the race is that good either. Yeah, we do. And, mate, that's to identify some juice in the race. Pretty much something that is at pretty rough odds, at least double-figure odds, where, hey, look, it's certainly not the favourite, but it's a winning chance, and the Brisbane Cup is that race for us this weekend. Look, it's no Sydney Cup, mate. Certainly no Melbourne Cup. But I still think you want a horse that is going to get the 3,200 metres pretty comfortably. And that horse for me is Salino, Sydney mm. Cup winner from a few years back. Mate, he could go over 5,000 metres pretty comfortably. He loves the dry deck. he loves love the distance. He's in for a big chance for me. Mate, Long Arm, who was in that same uh, Andrew Ramston, and he ran a really respectful ninth or 10th. Uh, but his form over the 2,800 metres and further... Is not great, but it's respectable. It's fine. Um, but he, he's about 30 to $40 with the good people at Neds. But there is a ton of chances in this race. True Marvel has bloody made him form uh, over the hurdles last start over two mile. He could feature. Yeah, Tiafilo Stars also got that hurdles form. Um, he's the favourite. So, oh, mate, it's a stinky race. Like you said, you just got to find some juice, find some value. Let's see how we go. See how we go.